Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. History TV's reality show Pawn Stars is one of the most popular shows. It showcases the daily life of the world famous gold and silver pawn shop based in Las Vegas, Nevada. The staff at the pawn shop have become a household name following the show's success. One of the staff members, Olivia Black, was under fire after some of her actions got revealed. Make sure to watch till the end, you surely do not want to miss out on this one. Despite her lasting popularity, Olivia Black disappeared from Pawn Stars in December of 2012, long before the shooting of Season 7 wrapped up. First hired as a night shift employee, she received extensive mentoring from Chum Lee before letting her selling and negotiation skills truly shine. A hard-working person, Olivia quickly established herself as a key member of the team only to part ways with them after less than two years. So, what happened? Was Olivia fired? Before getting into more interesting secrets, we want you to smash that subscribe button so we can keep bringing up videos for you. Olivia Black was fired from Pawn Stars after one of her photo shoots leaked. Olivia had to say goodbye to the cast and crew before her second season on Pawn Stars came to an end. She was fired after the National Enquirer leaked photographs from a shoot she did for Suicide Girls, a website and community promoting not-so-appealing photography. And it sounds like Pawn Stars head honcho Rick Harrison didn't have much to say in the decision. According to Fox News, he offered Olivia the opportunity to continue working for the Gold and Silver Pawn Shop as long as she didn't appear in front of the cameras. I never fired her. She's out doing her own thing now. It's just the production company did not want her working there anymore. What she does in her personal life is her business, Rick told Fox. Olivia said that she was too shocked to ask why she had to leave. I don't have an actual reason as to why I am not part of the show anymore. They didn't state it and I didn't ask. I was just in shock I didn't think to ask, Olivia told Fox. As Olivia confirmed, she and the crew of the Gold and Silver Pawn Shop parted ways on amicable terms with her deciding not to work there anymore. Several petitions are launched in the wake of Olivia's firing from Pawn Stars to bring her back. None of them were successful. Olivia sued the producers of Pawn Stars for wrongful termination. After being fired, Olivia sued Left Field Pictures, the production company behind Pawn Stars. According to her publicist, Dominic Nadi, Olivia believed that this intolerance for online nude photos seems to be only subjected to female television personalities, and because of that, Olivia has been advised to sue the production company for discrimination. Dominic revealed, While getting ready for the night shift one day, Olivia received a phone call at her house from Left Field Pictures, and with no further explanation, they informed her she will no longer be on Pawn Stars, shortly after the photos were uncovered. It's unclear what became of the lawsuit, which was originally filed in 2013. Well, what do you think? Did they do the right thing firing her from Pawn Stars? Do let us know in the comment section below. We're looking forward to reading your opinion. Olivia has built a career as a model, content creator, and adult film star. After leaving Pawn Stars, Olivia resumed her work as an erotic model and social media influencer. She launched a YouTube channel, Miss Olivia Black, in January of 2013. She and her partner, Maria Plaza, aka the Bear Naked Chef, have created several videos together, including vlogs and workout tutorials. Olivia and Maria appear to have stopped posting on YouTube over three years ago. They haven't shared updates on their website either. However, Olivia has stayed pretty active on her own website, where she shares her personal exclusive erotic content. That brings us to the end of today's video. Let us know in the comments down below if we missed something. Anyways, be sure to leave a like to the video if you enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys in the next one.